You got nothing to worry about, Reg. You got a crack team that still understands how to work with film cameras. We're behind you 100% on everything, man. Video, such bullshit. Pass A, man. Pass A. Done like dinner, you know what I mean? Uh-huh. Yeah, you know what I mean. You're original goddamn masters. How are we looking, Jill? The camera's good to go. We just need to load the film. Lighting needs another five. And we've got a PA on route with coffee for you and Reg. There he is, our DP for the day, Bill McGill. Next generation, if you will. We're little masters. <laughs> It's such an honor to meet you in person, man. I'm a big fan. Big fan. I find your work so laboratory, you know? Uh, uh, reveal it to How much work have you done on film cameras, son? Not as much as I'd like. <laughs> Producers, you know, they're always pinching pennies and, uh, hey, get out of here. I'm in love with you. beauty? You bet. Well built, voluptuous, heavy set. Just the way I like them. Right. <laughs> uh, you brought the film, right, Reggie? Oh, yeah. Now look here, son. This is the last bit of film in existence. It's just a short end, but it's sacred. Handled with utmost respect and reverence. Capiche? Thank you. Well, let's get you seated, Reggie. You do know how to load it, right? <laughs> yeah, of course. Hey, man, how do I load this shit? What is this thing? Mike, I need a little help here. Sorry, boss. Not my job. Send me up the river. Come on. She's the second. Hey, this is your job. Uh... This is your responsibility. Please, don't screw this up. This is the last short end, like, ever. Uh, sure. Alright guys, I'm here to show you how to load a film into the film magazine. The more important step, you have to be in the dark room. If you don't have access to the dark room, well, you can use a changing bag or changing tent. It's important you know expose the film before you load it the fifth side. Make sure the mat is completely clean. Treat the film very, very nice, okay? When this step is done, you can safely complete loading the take outside into the full light. Remember guys, do not expose the film. Happy shooting! Don't forget to come back. Happy loading guy. Take care. Holly, hurry up. Everyone's waiting on you. Almost done. Two seconds. Oh, so glad to have a good person. You do know what you're doing, right? Yeah, man. I got this. Okay, come on. Let's go. Let's go! Shit, shit. What? Expose the film. What do you mean you were Dolly! What the hell is taking so long? We've been waiting for this for like 10 minutes. I don't know what, I just, I... Are we ready to go, Dolly? Dolly! Are we good to go? We're good. We're goddamn like Wait, wait. I need to inspect it first. This is important. You can't muff this up. Good. I'm impressed. You didn't flash the mag, did you? All right, so are we ready? Now remember, this is a short end, so we only got about four minutes before it rolls out. So no farting around, capiche? We gotta stay on point. Hear that, guys? No farting. Take it from the master. All right, roll camera. Where's the record button? I don't know, I gotta find the exposure first. Is there no menu on this fucking thing? And only four minutes to take. Hello? What's that button? Uh, rolling. Okay, and sound? Sound speed. And slate. Original Masters interview one, take one. Marker. 
Hey, Frame. How can there be no flip out screen and no menu? Nothing. This is ridiculous. Still speeding. I just go on this. Do we have Frame? Burn and film, guys. The end's getting shorter. Frame. And action, Reginald Masters. What you are witnessing are the last images shot on 35 millimeter film in history. Hi, I'm Reginald Masters, one of the last remaining cinematographers of the old guard. Back in my day, we shot movies on film, real movies. We got our hands dirty. The smell of emulsion tickled our nostrils. The rattle of rolling film was a shooter's symphony. It was romance. But alas, we were star-crossed lovers, doomed to see our love wither away in the coldness of convenience. The empire of economy, the demon of democracy, the terror of technology. In other words, digital video was the bell that tolled for us film people. The crayons placed themselves next to the oil paints, and toddlers started shooting movies. To us, the old guard, it was sacrilege. The literature of film was traded in for the smut of ones and zeros. How could we continue? I vowed to stop shooting when the last remaining foot of film rolled through the gate. And that is what I am doing right here, right now. Film, you are my love. Film. You are my life. I am honored to be with you as you pass into the night. Through tungsten warm and daylight cold, you'll be remembered for the stories that you told. And as a final thank you for the life that you gave to me, I hereby pledge my loyalty. I'll never part from thee. Goodbye, old friend. Was that in the script? Uh, no. Reggie? Reggie? What lab? The film lab? The film lab? Reginald, or Reggie as he was affectionately called, was apparently recording one final message on what some say was the last and only non-electronic recording device in existence. We're anxiously awaiting the development of this recording device, apparently some type of lengthy chemical process, to determine his final message. Stay tuned for more information on this story. You did what? I exposed the film. I don't know what that means. What, what does that mean? Speak English to me, Dolly. It means I opened the mag when I shouldn't have, and so the film's gonna come out white, like overexposed. <laughs> okay. 
Now you listen to me. The whole world is waiting on that thing. So fix it. I don't care how you fix it. I'll try, Lee, but I don't- Fix it! I don't care how you fix it. Fix it. Okay, I'll fix it, fix it. Okay, I'll fix it, fix it. Lee? Okay, I'll fix it, fix it. Fix it. Okay, I'll 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 fix it. Fix it. Fix it. Well, folks, we finally have the video of the film of Reginald Masters' final message. Please note this video has been censored for our younger viewers. Here we go. And as a final thank you for the life that you gave to me, I hereby pledge my loyalty. I'll never part from thee. Goodbye, old friend. We will be sure to keep Mr. Master's family in our prayers and our thoughts during this difficult time. But wow, I do have to say this has to be one of the most captivating stories in recent memory. And now for the weather with Miguel. Miguel? <laughs> what a story, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, what a story. Wow. I mean, he blew his head right off. Bam! Now that's balls to the wall television right there, huh? <laughs> Jeez. You know what? I don't even know exactly what he meant, but... So we have a polar vortex coming, folks, for you tomorrow. Get ready, it's gonna get cold. Guess what I, do. I don't care how you fix it. Fix it. I don't care how you fix it. Fix it. I don't care how you fix it. Fix You got nothing to worry about, Red. You got a crack team that still understands how to work with film cameras, and we're with you, behind you, 100% on. Action, General Master. General Master. Okay, go. Ready? And video, such bullshit. Pass A, man. Pass A. Done like dinner. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Yeah, you know what I mean. You're Reginald Jackson. All right. And action. What's his name? What is his name? Action, Reginald Master. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> uh, producers, always pinching pennies. Hey, what do you? I'm going to like that. Okay, and uh, this time you go. Action. And action. Okay. And action. <laughs> what is this? Mike, I need your help here. Sorry, boss. Not my job. Hey, don't tell me the river. Okay. I gotta get some paper towel or something so I don't have to eat it. <laughs> He's dead! He's dead! Fucking A, right? He's dead. I miss my dad! I don't know what that's about. Okay. Goodbye, old friend. And cut.